Hey guys, uh, what's up? It's Jack uh, again, and um, today it's gonna be uh, an updated weapon of choice video. So you may be wondering if you've been on my channel for a while, like, or you've watched my videos for a while. I already have an updated weapon of choice, but I've really noticed that that's <laughs> um unrevel unrelevant. Sorry, I can't pronounce that word. Um, just because I'm not even using that stick anymore. So um. Yeah, I did change, uh, just kind of by accident, so, let's get into the stick. It is a Warrior, it's like, get in the light, Warrior Nas X, lacrosse head, yeah, uh, has Nas technology, which makes it really light. Uh, my shooting video, I use this, and, um, Nas, I give it a 9 out of 10. Just because they are, my other one's really flexible, and this one's kind of flimsy. But I mean, I kind of like that. Uh, the pocket, it looks shallow. Well, I'll put the ball in it. It's an x back head, which means it's legal for college and NCAA rules. Well, NCAA rules, and you can use it in high school. Well, you can use it for any age group. So, the way this is strung, it's like a low um, U. Which I like. I have to change up my stringing though soon because for my summer team, it, we play by NCAA rules now, which means that I have to have this shooter rule, college shooter rule, can't below four inches or three inches. So I'm gonna have to do something about this. Uh, I really love the pocket on this though. Maybe I'll just experiment with my other one, with my other nods during the spring season. But another thing about this head, I'm thinking of getting Wax Mesh soon. Uh, once I get a decent amount of money stacked up, because I'm looking to buy a couple things. Um, mesh is the only lacrosse related thing. Um, but the reason I want to get some Wax Mesh is because during the um, spring season, it's kind of this thing that goes on every year with me. I use a head, and then during practice it'll be like after it rained. And my head will get completely screwed up. And I'll, because it, it won't be throwing right, I'll just switch to my backup. And then I'd use my backup for the rest of the year, and this will just be abandoned. So I'm thinking about getting some wax mesh. And an idea for anybody, uh, I guess this idea was like thought of a while ago, but I just want to bring it up. Say, like DMG or RTLX7, because they make wax mesh. Uh, what about wax shooting strings? Because people are always saying that when, like, your mesh gets wet and you're using wax mesh, shooters are the only things that get wet. Why not just make wax shooting strings and just sell a complete package? Uh, it's probably already been thought of, but just thought I'd put that out there. But I'm looking to either get pen mesh or G DMG mesh. I might just get both and do, like, reviews on them and see what I like better. But that's what the head, that's the head. Let me show you the pocket. I'm at my dad's desk for a computer. Uh, it's pretty much practically mine, too. Put the pocket on this. It's a low pocket. It actually has really, like, good ball feel. It doesn't look that deep, but it breaks in. Like, this mesh doesn't do it justice because when it pounds it in, it's nice, but then it just shrinks back. So, this is a good camera angle. Yeah, that comes out 90 degrees. Uh... I love this head. I wish I could get another. Oh, I actually might get another one. I don't know. But the shaft is an oh, 2008 Warrior Crypto Pro Diamond. I got this from my friend around 2009. And I've like kept it ever since. It's like my baby. It's got like dents up here. Like right there. Right there. Right there. Yeah, but it's just gone through so much. I like Crypto Pro Diamonds. Those are the only real shafts I use. And I just can't say anything more. It's like my absolute baby. Got a like rebel butt taped about a third of the way up. Work Crypto Pro Diamond, light, very durable. Um, a lot of people don't like the Crypto Pro Diamonds because they're like because of the sandpaper grip. Take it from somebody who actually uses like them religiously. Once that sandpaper grip is gone, it has the nicest grip of all shafts. Take it from me, I've used the Sci-Tie, Scandium Pro, Dolomite Diamond, 
all those shafts and nothing, none of them compare to this. All my diamonds kind of heavy. Sci tie Pro. I don't know if it's just Sci ties in general or just because mine was like bent. Uh, I rap checked the kid. It was fun. But yeah, it was just super heavy. I didn't like it. So yeah, that was my weapon of choice video. I recommend both these, both of this. I recommend this combo. Um, thanks for watching the video, guys. I hope you like it. Uh, leave a like on my videos. It really, really appreciate it. But if you haven't watched my other videos, like my shooting video, just go ahead and watch that. Sorry that it was mainly right-handed and they were most like sidearm. I don't shoot sidearm in games. Uh, I usually just sit like seven to ten yards away from the crease and just rip. But thanks for watching the video, guys. See you.